And the part of the work that we're doing is we're really crazy maniacs about data because we, we've realized in the midst of all the work that we're doing that if we do a good job of getting people on a trajectory where they don't recidivate and we can make a case for what successful reentry looks like, um, we now can be a part of changing the narrative in these conversations. And that's what's really getting exciting. And so, and that's where we are today is about taking data, and it's way more than data, it's about human beings. But it's about doing something we haven't done in our country, and that is to humanize this issue. Put a face on it. That's why we've got some dynamic folks that are doing some work on interviews and you know, looking at our clients. Because I can tell you, I've been doing it for 20 years. And we've worked with over 6,500 um, men, women, and youth. And 99.9% .9 of them have touched my heart in the most incredible way. And, and I think we're, we're just hopeful that America gets the chance to see th these folks through the same lens that we have. You know, so, so we appreciate you guys coming today to, you know, to kind of get a sense because this is how the change happens. People come and experience. Um, you learn a little bit. And then when you go out and talk to somebody, you have something else you can talk and it keeps that thing going. And so we hope you guys will all become champions with us in this work because it's really important work and people deserve it. And, uh, and our city is going to be a city of second chances, I hope. I mean, that'd be a neat name, wouldn't it?